Thanks for joining me for another weekly candidate-free Sudoku puzzle solve. Do comment and let me know what you think about my channel. And please subscribe if you like these videos. This is puzzle number 90 from Sudoku to Go volume 159. You can always print the puzzle before you watch. Just click on the um, link in the description below to be able to print this puzzle. You can also go to this um, sudokuprimer.com to this page here in this menu item. And uh, you can print lots of other puzzles from there. And each of those puzzles has a link to a video. So if you want to watch um, how that puzzle is solved. Well, today I'd like to explain what I'll call the missing digit in Sudoku puzzles. As you scan this puzzle, do you see a number that is nowhere on the grid? If you study it, you'll see that there are no threes. Now look at the grid again. Do you see any other digits that are missing? Let's see, one, two, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. There are only threes missing. There's no other digit that's missing. An interesting fact about Sudoku puzzles is you'll never see a puzzle that has more than one digit missing. Now, why is that? Because if you have two missing digits, you could interchange the two digits and you would have two solutions. Look at Sudoku puzzles before you solve them. See if you can find one that lacks more than one digit at the start. I'll bet you'll, you won't be able to find one. Well, let's solve this puzzle. First of all, we've got a... Uh, Uh, one here, one here, so that's a one. And we've got a right angle pattern right here with a one here and a one here, so that's a one. Uh, we've got sevens here and sevens here, so that's a seven. And we've got another right angle pattern right here with a five in this column and a five in this row, so that's a five. All right, and now we have a six here, go sixes there, and a six here, so that's a six. And with this six, we have six, six, that's a six. Also in uh, um, box five here, we've got an eight here, ghost eights there, and an eight there. That makes that an eight. And with that eight there, we've got an eight here, eight here, eight here. So we'll put an eight right there. And at this point, we have um, a couple of twins that I notice right here. We've got a two and a five in this row already. So this is, these are two five twins. And these are three six twins right here. And other than that, that's about the only thing I can find readily. So now we're getting, now I'm just getting kind of, this, this puzzle is getting kind of difficult. Uh, but I did notice one thing about these two cells right here. Let's see what this cell can see and what it can't see. Let's see. It's missing one, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. It's missing one, three, and six. Okay, let's see what this cell is missing. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Three and six. 
So this one is missing 1, 3, and 6. This is missing 3 and 6. Now remember our 3, 6 twins right here, and we're going to use these 3, 6 twins a few times in different, different uh, situations. Well, we have 3, 6 twins here. We have 1, 3, 6 here and 3, 6 here. So that means if we use unique rectangles, we've got 3, 6 twins there and 3, 6 twins there. And that means that can't be a 3 or a 6, so that has to be a 1. So that's a, a bit of a difficult number to find, but we were able to find it using unique rectangles there. Okay, now we've got 1, 1 here, and 1 there, 1 there, so that's a 1 also. Okay, and then let's look at uh, column 6 here. Let's see what we're missing. 1, 3, 4, 7. 1, 3, 4, and 7. Well, here's a 1, so that's a 3, 4, or a 7. Actually, it's a 4 or a 7 because we have these 3, 6 twins here. So 1, 3, 4, 7. Here we have a 1, so 3, 4, 7. There's a 4 here, 1, 3, 7, and uh, <clears throat> right here is uh, 1, 3, 4 because of that 7. So readily, um, right, at, right at first we can't really see anything, but let's look at it a little closer. We've got a 7 here and a 7 here, so one of these is a 7. So that means that can't be a 7. All right, so that is a 4 because we've got a 1 here and three six twins there. That makes that a four. Before I fill that in, I want to show you another way of looking at this. We've got um, three six twins here. So that means one of these cells is a three and one of these cells is a three. So if we use double column elimination, three, three, the three has to be here. And we've got ones here already, so this has to one of these has to be a one, one of these has to be a seven, and one of these three has to be a three. So we have one, three, seven triplets here. A couple of different ways to find that four right there. All right, and now with this four, we've got a four here and a four there. So one of these is a four. So we have a four here, ghost fours here and a 4 there, that makes this a 4 right there. Okay, and now with this 7 here and this 7 here, we have ghost 7s here. So 7, ghost 7s, so that makes that a 7. So all we're missing now is 1 and 3 there. Let's see, <clears throat> and then let's um, let's look at this cell right here and see what we're missing. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So that's a three. The only number that we couldn't see from that cell is a three, and with this three um, here. It has to be a 3 in one of these two cells. And remember our 3, 6 twins, which we've used a couple times already. Well, that makes, um, makes it so we can't have a 3 here. In fact, we've only got two numbers left here. Um, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, and 9. 7 and 9 there. So that makes that a 3. All right, and then we're only missing three and seven in row six here. With this three, we can put in a seven there and a three there. Now we finish that row. All right, now we're missing seven and nine there, and uh, there's only a nine missing there. Remember, these were seven and nine, and these are seven and nine. With that seven and that nine, that makes that a seven and that a nine. And then um, let's 
See, with a nine here and a nine here, we can put a nine there. And uh, now we've got a nine here, nine here, nine here. So that's a nine also. And now we've got um, a seven here. So we've got seven, seven, seven. So we can put a seven right there. Now let's look at column five. What are we missing here? Three, four, five. Three, four, and five are missing here. Well, um, that could be a three, four, or a five. But see these four and this four and five numbers here? That means these got to be four and five because. We've already got a six, nine, two, and eight in here. Six, nine, two, eight in here. So with these four, this with this four and five here, with that four, we can fill those in. And also the three is a loner cell. Before we filled these four, the four and five in here, we could have seen this was a loner cell. We've already got a one here, a seven here, and two, six, and nine. Six and nine. So the three is the only number that's not in this column that still needs to be filled in here. And so that's, that's a loner cell right there. All right, and now let's see. Let's see what we're missing here in column seven. Three, five, six, three, five, and six. So that's a three, five, or a six. That's a three, five, or a six. Oh, there's a three and a six there, so we can put a five there. All right, and now let's look at box nine here. We've got a corner pattern there. We've got a nine and a four here and a nine and a one there, so that's not going to help us. But um, here we have a three and a six right there. <coughs> And remember our three six twins here, and we determined that that was a three and a six um, when we were looking at it earlier. So we have three six twins here and three six twins here. So these are three six twins right there. And so we're only missing one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, five and eight here. With that five, we can fill those in. And now we've got eights here, so eight, eight. We've also got an eight here and an eight here. So that makes this an eight right there. And let's see, we've got an eight here, an eight here, an eight there. So that's an eight. And we've got an eight here, eight here. So that makes that an eight. What are we missing here? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So four and five are missing there. Can't solve those yet. Let's see here. So these are four and five right there. We've got a four here and a four here. So one of these is a four. So that's got to be a four right there because we've got a four here and a four here. So that's got to be a four right there. We could also see that there's a four already in this column and a four in this column already. So that leaves two and nine in row one. We've got a two there, so we can fill those in. And uh, we've got fives here, so we can put a five in box one right there. And now we're only missing one, two, three, four, six. Four and six there. Four and six there. With that five, we can fill in the four and five there. Got a four there and a five there. That makes this a six and that a four. Okay. And the only thing we're missing in column one here is a two.
With this 5 here, we can fill in the 2 and 5 here. Those are those two 5 twins that we found early on. Uh, remember our 3 6 twins, we still can't fill those in. Not yet. Um, well, we have a 2 here and a 2 here, so that's a 2. All right, and remember we had 1 3 here. Let's see what we're missing here. One, one and nine there. We've got a nine there, so we can fill those in. Now we're only missing three six here, one three here, and three six, three six, three six. So We've got a 1 and 3 here, and 3, 6, 3, 6, 3, 6, 3, 6. Let's fill in the 1 and 3 there, because we, we got that 1 there. All right, so with this 3 right here, we've got a 6 right here, so we can fill in those. So let's see, 3, 6, makes that a 3, that a 6, 3, 6, 3, 6. And we're done. Okay. Well, this puzzle, puzzle wasn't the hardest, but we had to get creative at a couple of points to find the next number. The three six tw twins right here really helped us, if you remember. That uh, helped us find that one and that one, and that got us going again. And then we used those three sixes here to find that three and to find, um, let's see, to find this four, help us find that four. And that really helped a lot. And if you if you noticed, I, those three and six were the last two numbers I filled in in the puzzle. Now we could have filled them in a little bit earlier, but we almost had to wait till the very end before we could even fill these three six twins in. But we used them. Um, a few times to uh, find other numbers. Well, thanks for watching. I'll see you next on, on the next video.